Hey guys, it's Theodore Lee, and welcome to Gas Laws, a game about gas particles. This is the second game that I built using GameMaker language, and we I did it with Carmen Compton, if you couldn't tell. Now, if you see this title screen, it's so expertly created, like, you can really tell that we put a lot of time into it. So let's get into it. WSD to enter, I already know this. So, I'm not going to be talking while the uh, audio clips are going, so yes. Okay, Orion. So every gas is full of gas particles. These particles will react depending on what you do to them. Now go fill up a balloon. Cool, let's do that. You got deflated balloon. Cool. You inflated the balloon. Sounds about right. This balloon is now full of gas particles which are bouncing around. They hit each other and bounce off, creating the pressure to push the walls of the balloon out. If you squeeze the balloon, there is the same amount of gas particles in a smaller space, which is the resistance that you feel, and that's why the other parts of the balloon expand. Now use that needle to pop the balloon. You got the needle. Mm -hmm. Now the gas particles that were in the balloon are released, and they're now in the air around us. Go fill up another balloon and bring the cold bucket. I totally didn't just, like, flick an empty water bottle to make that sound. You got deflated balloon. You inflated the balloon. You got the cold bucket. Good. Now put the balloon in the cold bucket. The gas particles in the balloon got less excited from the cold, and that made them move slower. That means that they bounce off of each other less, and that lowers the pressure and makes the balloon smaller. Now go grab the heated bucket. You got the hot bucket. Now put the balloon in the heated bucket. The gas particles in the balloon got more excited from the warmth, meaning that they hit each other more and that they move faster. This increases the pressure and makes the balloon expand. Why don't you go ahead and get a hands-on look? I created a machine that'll turn you into a gas particle. Head on to the next room and we can check it out. Sounds about right. Ooh, very nice. Look at all these expertly things that you can totally just walk through. Alright, and now we are the gas particle going into the balloon. Eh, I don't know why. I don't know why it's this complex. But basically the way we did this is this entire thing is a sprite. And I just put it in a room and set a timer so it would just work. I would just teleport me to the next room after it's finished. Perfect. Be careful. Hitting other gas particles will damage your bubble, which, if it breaks, you will die. Okay, so this is actually kind of hard. Um, but I did lower the time, because five minutes for this room is just way, way, way too long, and everyone I talked to got bored by the end of it. So, yeah, I just have to try to avoid these uh, gas mo <clears throat> molecules. Um, I don't, I mean, like... Right now it's easy. I'm now going to inflate the balloon. Until he does what that. this will do is have more gas particles in the same amount of space, so the gas particles will bounce off of each other more. Yep, sounds about right. So let me head to the top because he's inflating it, or I'm inflating it from the bottom. No, no, don't get trapped. Okay, so I have... No, damn it. I have three lives. Uh, each one cracks my bubble a little bit more. Hopefully I can get this to work, but if not, it'll show you the death screen. Uh, I'm going to cool down the balloon. What this good, will do is slow down good, the good, gas good. particles. Good, good, good. Very good. Okay, now they're all a lot slower. And of course I get hit. Any twice! Great. Because I'm professional at my own game. I can just kind of hang on the wall. Just get out of the way of those guys. Um, the, in a couple seconds, uh, he's gonna make it faster. So that's gonna suck. Actually, no, I should get out of here. I'm gonna get trapped. I'm now going to heat up the balloon. This is gonna make the gas particles move faster. Jesus. Oh, Jesus! Ah, no! Oh, wait, no. I have one life. I, uh, if I get hit once, it's over. No! No! <laughs> Alright, well, rip. Damn it. Alright, well, he passed as a gas. Uh, definitely not anything else implied there. Definitely not. Alright, uh, hold on. Let me just change that so that 
it goes straight to the balloon so I can show you what happens when you do beat it. Alright, so let's go ahead and rebuild this. That's just going to teleport me straight into the balloon. It's going to skip the whole, um, uh, like, human stage. Puny humans. Haha. <laughs> Molecules are better. Be careful. Hitting other gas particles will damage your bubble, which, if it breaks, you will die. Okay, I think I'm just going to skip the video here and until it gets to the fast part again. Because that was really difficult. And you guys will see anyway, like how. Oh god! Ah. You guys will see my state of being by then, as in how much life I have. Alright, let me just go find a wall to hang on to real quick. I'm now going to inflate the balloon. What this will do is have more gas particles in the same amount of space, so the gas particles will bounce off of each other more. No! I'm going to cool down the balloon. What this will do is slow down the gas particles. I'm now going to heat up the balloon. All right, here we go. This is going to make the gas particles move faster. I've got two hits left in me. Uh, oh, God. See, the thing about this game is that since the bubbles go in a random direction when they hit each other, it's a lot about luck. And it's different every single game. So, God. If I just stay here, I should be fine. Okay, the molecules are starting to thin out now because a lot of them got Okay, stopped. I think you've seen enough. It's time for you to turn back into a human. Sweet, now I'm a human. Now, if you'll see, there's this little hot air balloon thingy. It's just an Easter egg. It's basically another balloon, so let's get to it. Be careful. Hitting other gas particles will damage your bubble, which, if it breaks, you will die. So, this is basically the same thing, except every single event... Uh, the things just get faster and faster until it's absolutely ludicrous. It actually gets... Oh, God. Why do I always take, like, at least one damage in the first stage? Come on. Alright, come on. This is just a fun room. You don't actually... It's not actual part of the game. You don't learn anything from it. It's just because hot air balloons are constantly pumping in hot I'm now going to heat up air. the balloon. This is going to make the gas particles move faster. Holy balls. Oh, it's funny because these are technically... Well, no, they're circles. Balls have to be three-dimensional. Um, it kind of balances out, though, because, like I said... Oh, shoot. Um, uh, as the time goes on, they get faster, but there are less of them because they delete each other when they get stuck. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, that's bad. Oh, I'm that's now bad. going to heat up the balloon. This is going to make the gas particles move faster. Okay, now... Or they're just all going to get stuck. That's... Huh. That's weird. They just all got stuck. 